Welcome to the Department of Historical and Heritage Studies. My name is Charlene Herselman and I am the course coordinator for the Heritage and Cultural Tourism degree. Our department offers two main options you can enrol for, history and heritage and cultural tourism. We offer a degree, a Bachelor of Social Science in Heritage and Cultural Tourism, while you can enrol for a number of history modules at undergraduate level to complement your chosen degree. We also offer several postgraduate degrees in history as well as heritage and cultural tourism. Why should you enrol for a degree in heritage and cultural tourism? Tourism is one of the world's biggest industries and the fastest growing industry in Africa. It is also one of the biggest job creators in South Africa and it is anticipated that South Africa will increasingly rely on tourism revenues. Tourism, and especially heritage and cultural tourism, is however considered a scarce skill and we need trained professionals to drive this growth. At the University of Pretoria, we provide you with an overview of international and domestic tourism trends and we strongly believe in providing training to prepare you for the ever-changing work environment by creating opportunities for you to develop multidisciplinary and transferable skills like being a creative problem solver, a skill that is much needed now that the tourism industry will have to adapt to a whole new way of operating with the COVID-19 pandemic and its aftermath. You will also learn to be a critical thinker, how to find credible information, interpret and analyze it, and present it in a logical way. You will learn to be an innovative entrepreneur. Our students completing an honors degree receive on-the-job training by running all aspects of the UP Campus Tours Agency, from finances to marketing. You will also learn how to comfortably express yourself in front of others, as public speaking is an important skill in tourism. What career opportunities are available in heritage and cultural tourism? After studying heritage and cultural tourism, most graduates choose careers in the heritage, or tourism industries or in education. Your choice will very much depend on the interests you develop throughout your studies and your personality. Potential careers include tourist guide, tour operator, travel agent, educator, journalist, entrepreneur, government official, site or museum guide, tourism developer, travel writer, researcher, consultant. In the tourism marketing, or hospitality industries. Many of our former students have gone on to start their own businesses or have gone to work in the public sector like the National Department of Tourism or the South African Heritage Resources Agency or have found employment in the private sector like at booking.com. Why should you enroll for history modules? History will provide you with essential historical background and context for your studies in any direction in the humanities and beyond. Remember, every subject has a history. History modules entail two aspects. Firstly, they are designed to highlight the key historical events which shape the progress of humankind. And secondly, you are also taught skills which are critical to your studies, such as how to read critically, write coherently, analyze and collate information, substantiate your arguments, and organize and formulate information effectively and logically. We present a wide range of history modules, from global to local, from the world to Africa and South Africa. We offer overview courses at first year level, moving to more specialized modules at second and third year. What career opportunities are available when I study history? After studying history, many of our graduates find careers in journalism, filmmaking, education, librarianship, 
politics, international relations, archiving, museums, tourism, curation, legal research, genealogy and public service. How can I apply to study in historical and heritage studies? For all the information you need about the available study options and how to apply, please visit the university's webpage and look for the yearbook section under the study section. You will be able to find information about our undergraduate heritage and cultural tourism degree and history modules if you search for us under the Faculty of Humanities undergraduate degrees and modules. You need an APS of at least 28 with a 5 for your NSC IEB examinations or a C for your AS level in English home language or first additional language to apply for the heritage and cultural tourism degree. We hope to welcome you soon in historical and heritage studies.